This document is about adding with uncertainties. So when quantities with uncertainties are combined, the results have uncertainties as well. So this is going to discuss addition. And we're going to use exam for the examples, the quantities we're going to use is x, which has a value of 2 plus or minus 1, and y, which has a value of 32 plus or minus 0.2. So for example, suppose we call z the sum of these two quantities. Then the smallest value of z will be when we add the smallest value of x to the smallest value of y. The biggest value of z will be if we use the biggest value of x and add it to the biggest value of y. The nominal value of z is what we get if we ignore the uncertainties and just add the, the nominal value of x to the nominal value of y. So, that means that the smallest value z can have is 32.8, the biggest value z can have is 35.2, and the nominal value is 34. So we can say that z is 34 plus or minus 1.2 because 1.2 is the difference between the minimal value and the nominal value, and it's also the difference between the maximum value and the nominal value. So we can see that the uncertainty in z is just the sum of the uncertainties in x and y, 1 plus 0.2. So in general, when we add quantities, we add the uncertainties. So graphically, we can look at it like this. So this bar from here to here represents the value x, and these two little purple bars represent the uncertainty in x. This pink bar represents y, and these two little yellow bars represent the uncertainty in y. So adding them together is like putting them end to end. So the nominal value of x plus y is just the length of this whole bar. If we redraw it to put the uncertainties at one end, then it looks like this. So now, the minimum value of x plus y is the value ignoring these two little uncertainty bits on the end. So the minimum value of x plus y is this. So the uncertainty in the sum is the difference between the nominal value, which is the whole thing, and the minimal value, which is here. And so that difference is delta x plus delta y. Now for the maximum value of x plus y, again we take the maximum value of x, add it to the maximum value of y, and so we get this. So again we can rearrange it, so now we have the nominal value of x, which goes over to here, and the nominal value of y, which goes over to here, and then we get this little additional bit out here. So the little additional bit out here is the uncertainty in x plus the uncertainty in y. So now if we rearrange the whole thing we can see this. Here we have the minimum value of x plus y, here we have the nominal value over to here, and over to here we have the maximum value. So we can see that the nominal value is to here plus or minus this part here, like this. So when adding numbers, we add the absolute uncertainties. So for example, like in our example, 2 plus or minus 1 plus 32 plus or minus 0.2 gives us 34 plus or minus 1.2. And in final results, we usually round uncertainties to one decimal place and make the quantity agree. So 34 plus or minus 1.2 becomes 34 plus or minus 1.